Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can insert a 3D table or the set of data that you have. Uh, this is gonna be a short, quick video. Um, so let's get right into it. Um, so if you have a view, so if you have a set of data like this that represents um, what have you, for example, this one I just created off the top of my head, um, we have vehicle zone, we have vehicle numbers, and then for example, this represents the number of defects per vehicle um, or whatever you may have. Um, so what you can do is to illustrate this in a 3D uh, chart is you can go to insert tab, you can click here, and then here you can see you have different options. Uh, you have 2D columns and you have 3D columns, you can, you can show them um, where the columns go straight up, or you can show them where the columns are going from left to right. Uh, the best way, in my opinion, if you're trying to represent your table in 3D format is if you click on this one, uh, it'll give you a chart. So um, here you can see we have our vehicle zones here in the x-axis and we have our vehicle numbers um, on the y-axis and then the number of defects per vehicle is going up on the z-axis um, and then you can play around how you want to uh, show them um, but yeah that's it you can change the title you can add um, um, access titles a bunch of other parameters that if you want to make your data uh, look more um, complete uh, you can do that. Um, so hope that helped you guys. Uh, if you have any other questions or any recommendations on which what you want to see in the next video, let me, let me know in the comments below. And uh, thanks for watching.